Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Sean from Tech Jobs Economy, to come to Sam Pete. I just got wanted to give you guys a quick um little more information on the Xbox One S uh Scorpio edition. Um just because I felt like my unboxing was a little bit short um on some key um two key details. Um first is the actual numbering on the box. Um so if you guys ever have the chance or have a chance to see a Scorpio edition box you guys will see that it does have some unique numbering uh, right next to the Xbox logo um, 01, 05, 10, 13, 17 um, and they are read as pairs um, pretty much like I just said there and I'll break it down to you guys the 01 uh, is the year that the first Xbox was released the 05 uh, is 2005 which is the year that the Xbox 360 was released. 2010 um, is the year that the Kinect sensor for the Xbox uh, 360 was released. 2013 is when the Xbox One was released, the uh, successor to the Xbox 360. And uh, 2017 is the release year of the Xbox One X uh, console, which is the mid uh, tier or mid year um, upgrade to the original Xbox, uh, I guess mid mid season session, however you would phrase that um, console run. So pretty much how long the Xbox One X is supposed to go for. Um, this is like a mid cycle upgrade is probably the best word for that. Um, so yeah, just wanted to give you guys that as well as uh, the Xbox One X. I believe is forty percent. Um, more powerful than the Xbox One. So that's another big uh, addition to the Xbox One X compared to the original Xbox um, that you're going to notice. So not only will games play a lot smoother, especially on a 1080p TV, um, but then it also does have that extra horsepower to be able to kick out that 4K um, ultra high definition um, high dynamic range gaming, uh, as well as it'll still play smoother um, on the One X console because it is quite a bit heftier, um, or excuse me, it will play a lot smoother than the One uh, Xbox One console before it. Um, also, another difference is that it is a quite a bit heftier. It's a more um, dense console than the previous one, so it does seem to be a little bit heavy. Um, and you'll notice that if you pick up a box, so you guys, the console and my entertainment system, you guys can see the Xbox logo there. Um, it's kind of hard to see, it's a little dark, um, but it does say, let me see if I can get that to focus for you guys. It does say uh, Project Scorpio Edition. It's kind of hard to see. Um, again, Project Scorpio Edition was a console that was kind of made. Um, for the uh, pre-orders of the Xbox One X console, so the early adopters got it, as well as other people that were able to get their hands on it. Um, so as you guys can see right now, I actually do have it set up on my TV. Um, however, I'm having it update the the OS um, on it, or the software on it, so it's going to take a little bit of time. Um, right now it's outputting in 1080p, however my TV is uh, 4K, it's a Sony 900E, so it'll definitely be capable. Of outputting that full 4K resolution. All right. Um, hope you guys like this little uh, kind of short, quick um, video. I apologize for the impromptu manner of it. Um, you know, I don't really have it attached to my tripod, my camera, or anything like that. So I'm just uh, kind of freehanding it. Um, but uh, if you guys do want to see more content, please subscribe to my channel. And I'll talk to you guys in a later video. Goodbye.